Welcome back to the positive side of sports and entertainment as Beaudry RV has taken us down the road and brought our Verve Zone studios here to the Moody Blues. Uh, I, should I say boutique? Is that the best way to put it? Larry, I saw your picture all over their ad and I'm like, man, what kind of place did I show up? You got all the you got all the bling going and everything. Well, man, Randy, uh, you know, takes care of me, man. He's always since I've been out here. You know, he, he walks with me and, you know, it's almost like family. You know, he just invite us over, come over and shop at the store and, uh, you know, he always takes good care of us. You know what? I love the fact you said takes good care of us. That's kind of what Coach Wiz and I just got through saying about you, that you took good care of him uh, this past Sunday. What a thrill for you guys and what a thrill for the fans. It, it, was such a, it was such a crazy atmosphere. I mean, back and forth, you know, kickoff returns, turnovers, interception. It was just so back and forth. But, uh, you know, in years past, you know, we were found a way to lose a game like that. And now this team, we're just able to fight. No matter what the deal is, the adversity, we're able to overcome it. Talking with Kurt Warner on the radio show this week, he mentioned that when you get back in the huddle, there's not a lot you can tell the guys that they don't already know, except for the... Forget about what just happened. Let's just take a look at right now going forward. Yeah, you can't do anything to control what happened in the past. I mean, all you can do is control what's, what's going to happen. Um, you know, make your block, make your catch, um, you know, hold on to the football, things like that. And that's the only thing you can really control. You can't go back and take plays back. You talked about being at home, your own food, your own bed and everything. You know, here's the thing. Coach Wisenhunt is the coach. I mean, he, not everything's going to go his way the entire year. There was a lot of talk about you guys being away from your families for 10 days. Uh, was this as tough as it sometimes was being written about you guys? Um, no, I wouldn't say it was that tough, but it was definitely, you know, we're creatures of habit. You know, uh, you know, used to coming home, doing the things that you're used to doing. But, you know, as, as an athlete and as a professional, you can't make excuses. Uh, we didn't get the job done on the road like we should have been able to. And uh, Coach Wiz is not to blame. Um, you know, us 53 guys have to be able to get the job done no matter what happens. Hey, let's bring, let's bring in your little boy, uh, Devin. He's uh, nine months old, and obviously I think one of the cool things was when you pulled up, you brought him here by yourself, and you said, "Oh, geez, he was a little fussy out here," but but you were smiling with him and carrying him, and he's just he's just a lot of fun. We've all had a chance to play with him a little bit. Come on, Devin, come up here and sit with Daddy. There What's going go. on, man? We can, we What's can going hear, on, big fella? We can hear you in the background and, and everything. What's going on there? You know, how much how much has he changed your life? Well, I man, he really changes your life a lot. I mean, he really, uh, from, the, from the smallest things you do, from driving too fast, you know, you slow down and drive, <laughs> you know, you're on time, you know, just, just things like that. He, he really makes, uh, you know, life worth living and uh, it's truly a blessing. What are some of the things that, that you're able to relate to when you're with him uh, as far as some of the things that might stay with you after a football game? Then when you come home to him, you're like, hey, wait a minute, man. It wasn't yeah, that big of a deal you know, after all. It really does. It puts it puts things into perspective. I mean, really, um, this is our livelihood, you no know, playing ball, but uh, but 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 what's most important is family. And uh, you know, <laughs> when when you, when you come home and he got that smile in his face, and uh, not right not right now, but most no, times this, when he got that no, when he got is, when he got that smile on his face, you know, it really makes everything worthwhile. Come on, baby. What are some of the things Look, you like to do? Um, well. He loves he loves playing. Um, he loves playing ball. I'm trying to teach him how to catch right now, but he's just really not that interested in it right now yet. But uh, you know, we go to the mall. He like he likes pulling everything off the shelves. We go to the grocery store. He pull everything off the shelves. So I mean, he has a good time. Man, I tell you what, Fitz, it's uh, it's a real honor, first of all, to be associated with you. Every time that we want to sit down with you, you give us all the time we ever want. Uh, one of the things that no, I no, really no, want, no, no, no. I really want fans no, to know no, no, about no, no. Uh, in this town is that Larry Fitzgerald is truly a class act. Uh, whether it's on the field or off the field, making a difference for the community, reaching out to some of the kids that don't have maybe some of the opportunities that we had while we were growing up, and that's not only what this Arizona Cardinal organization thrives on, but also his performance on the field as well. And just getting a chance to spend some time away from the practice facility uh, with his little boy here and his family, uh, just hanging out here, is obviously. Larry, for me, it's, it's, it's a real pleasure. It really is. Well, it's always a pleasure as well. I really appreciate you having me on. And besides the fact you push <laughs> Only thing positive about the media right here, I guess. <laughs> not a special job. No, you know what? No. That, that, that's, you know, here's the thing. Everybody has a job to do, mm -hmm. okay? And, and with controversy, obviously it sells. Yeah. But our biggest thing is uh, when you guys are losing, we're not dogging you. Yeah. And when you're winning, we're still here. Yeah. And, and, and unfortunately, if things aren't going in the right direction, we're still going to be around with you as we well. Re we really appreciate it. We need some positive things going for this team. All right. Well, I know one thing. I know you were going to do some shopping here at Moody Blue. Blues, but my biggest concern is since Scott Passmore has gotten here, nobody knows where he's at. So we're going to check it out, find out what he's shopping for here at Moody Blues.